Hello everyone and thank you for tuning in to my channel. This is Hollier411 and I'm going to be doing a reading today for the collective. So keep in mind this is a general reading. This may not resonate with everyone. This reading is... Um, I'm recording this reading on the 4th of December, so it's really whenever you watch it as well. It could resonate with you at any time. It could re resonate with you with um, a month from now, a week from now. Let me call on my spirit guides, my higher self, to guide and protect me in this reading. So let me be aware of the message being given to me so that I can give that message to you. I just want to see what the energies are for the collective Ace of Cups and the Queen of Swords. Some truth about love going on here. What's going on? There's that Queen of Swords again. Specific message for um, air signs, but not necessarily. Just wanted to say that. Okay, so what is the message? Judgment. Judgment card popped out. Making a, a decision, a wise decision. Not only that, being called to make a decision. This could be about forgiveness as well. Let's see what's going on. What are the energies? We have communication, we have traveling, going places, multitasking, definitely taking action, Sagittarius energy. Oh, fire, fire energy, passionate fire, needing to take action, you know, ready to go, ready actually on the, on the go. Fast, very fast paced energy we have. Someone's definitely taking action. Whew! And it has to be a fire sign, possibly. If not, this man has a, a passion, a passionate desire for love on his mind. And he's making no stops on the way. We have the Four of Coins. So he's holding on to something. He could be definitely holding on to... Um, Whatever it is that he wants to reveal to you, okay? Um, he could be holding on to these possessions that he holds so tightly towards his heart. It's a challenge for him to open up. This man is very vulnerable, but he's ready to take action. What's the possible outcome? Ooh, there's a completion. There's success. There's a lesson learned. Someone has completed a cycle, and now they're on another, they, it's like, you know, they, they, they completed a cycle, they, they've taken their action, um, and now I feel like this person is needing to open up as well as to reveal how they feel to you so that this can be completed with the world card. So let's see what's going on. We have the Eight of Wands here. So we definitely have victory, we have success, we have an 8 and a 9, so an 8 and 9, that is progression. This is someone who is very independent on their own, a very independent woman. Or it could be a man too. But something is definitely weighing heavily on his shoulders. We have an 8, 9, and a 10, all in one row, 8, 9, 10. Ready to put down the burden. Ready to meet he's this person single. Ready to meet somebody. I feel like this person has definitely been single long enough. I'm sick of doing this on my own. I need help. And that's what I'm taking action to. That's what I wanted to that's what I wanna do. That's what I'm going to do, but I'm moving cautiously. I'm having my awareness about me because I've been through some dark phases in my life. 
I made some bad decisions as well as good decisions and this is the best decision that I have made and I'm moving forward with it because I'm sick of being alone I could be a Leo or you could be dealing you know I, this person could be a Leo um, this person is uh, you know moving cautiously or you could be moving cautiously into this meeting someone this i feel like this man though is definitely coming to you or this man is ready to open up and to express himself he's ready he's already made that decision you know it's a quiet it's something that would that, that has been hidden he's been hiding away from it for some time and now it's just brought him down to his knees and you know this man is like I'm I'm ready you know I'm staying focused I'm that nine shining armor I'm taking action on what I desire and what I want I've been holding on I've been closed off for some time now something's coming in and shaking up his life not only that but you know there's the the tower moment the towers falling because he's not happy he might have everything material wise but he doesn't have a love and that's what he's looking for he's looking for love he's looking for that abundance he knows who he wants he knows who the, he, he this person or whoever this is they know who their soulmate is they think about him they daydream about him And I feel like this person is definitely going to take that leap of faith faith with the full card here. He's taking that leap of faith. He's he First off, first thing, he's taking all these wands off of his back. He's sick of crawling around, you know, being alone, being single. But this man or this woman has definitely gained a lot of uh, accomplishments within their life. They're very grounded, very secure, very independent. You know, we we have a tower moment here. And the tower moment has been, you know, I feel like this person has possibly, you know, uh, sacrificed some things, uh, giving away things, uh, um, possibly punish himself for some sort of reason because... Um, I don't know why, you know, I just feel like he's been hanging out for way too long, you know, and he's sick of being closed off. And, and you can see within this card right here, this man, he's, you see him right here holding on. He's not, he's not wanting to open up. Now he's like, look, I'm, I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready now. I'm dropping all those coins. I'm sick of, I'm sick of being closed off. And that's the tower moment is is about being alone. It's about opening up. I feel like this person's opening up. We have a queen of a queen of coins. We have fire signs, Sagittarius, Leo, Aries. We have Pisces, we have Libra, we have Gemini, Libra, uh, Aquarius, Leo's here. Really all signs. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. This queen, this this queen of coins, I feel like this this man is definitely moving towards this queen of coins here. This queen of coins is someone who is well grounded. Someone who knows what they want within the physical. They're very attractive and can and can attract what they want, what they most desire. This person is healing. They this person is healing. This could be be a relationship coming back to you because we have the star card, and um and the star card is about healing healing after a tower moment. So you know you guys could have been. Um, away for some time now, uh, apart for some time. Could be dealing with an Aries, Aquarius here, any sign. Been waiting for this time, waiting to heal. 
waiting to waiting to heal wait, waiting to um waiting to release this heavy burden that has been um weighed down that has been weighing you down but it it's also lifted you up Now we have Sagittarius coming in here with temperance. We have taking things slowly, taking things in moderation. We have the lover's card here making wise decisions, moving cautiously within in this connection. I got different cards and I just want to see. Let's see. Let, let's see. Let's just pull some of the Norman cards. I really feel like, you know, someone is sick of being single and they're ready to make a move now, but, and they're very serious. I feel like this person knows who they want and, um, they're going to be opening up to them. Okay. Um, expressing how they feel. There's going to be a lot of talk. They're going to call each other, talk on the phone, some sort of talking here with the birds, birds chatter, people talk fast it's gonna come in real fast and within time we have the time fast in time something's gonna happen very rapidly very fast it's communications coming at high right now look at all these clocks it's like past time <laughs> it's past time So, um, let's see what the angels have to say about this. Romance angels. What about this? Religious factors. Your love life is influenced by your religious upbringing and spiritual paths. This person is very traditional, has traditional ways, traditional values. He's not a player or she's not a player. This is new love. This is definitely new love. A new person. Someone that you would least expect. And this could be the one. You, it's you've already met your romantic partner that you seek, and it's new energy. I feel like it's new love, but it's a new energy of love. It's gonna be more on a traditional value. So beautiful, so beautiful. Okay, so think of something. Think of a question. Think of a question. Let's see if it'll answer. It says get more information. <laughs> if you would like a reading, you know what to do. My email is in the description box below. You guys have a good one.